My son is 18, so whenever we hang out, sometimes we drift off and talk about dating. And I think it's of the utmost importance that we have a conversation about females, you know, because he's at that age where curiosity can be so overwhelming and he's a handsome guy. So I was telling him about miscellaneous dating as I want to inform you because I was informing him of all of the times where I had miscellaneous conversations miscellaneous dates I fell into miscellaneous opportunities miscellaneous meaning I know it wasn't going anywhere I know I was just seizing the moment I know I was just wasting time why am I saying this because I told him I would be a millionaire if I had not tried to get it all why am I saying this because while you're in your lonely state or while you're not dating the temptation to have miscellaneous conversations can be overwhelming. It can be great. But I'm here to tell you, just like on the other side of that Red Sea, when the children of Israel was walking through it, there was a blessing. If you'll hold out and not have miscellaneous conversations and wait for that one meaningful conversation, things will be better. I told my son not to just be talking to females just because she's a female. Focus on self-development, focus on self-love, and then whoever and whatever is supposed to be for you will come your way. And to all my women and to all my men out there, focus on who you are becoming and everything else will come your way. Yeah, the tempta I had a temptation today that I was going to fall into. Yeah, there come. You're going to have a whole bunch of temptation, but you have to resist it. For the one that's to come. God is never going to bring the one that's to come while you have a replica in its place. <laughs> so let's focus. Do meaningful things in your life so that when the meaningful one comes, they can all they can just tap into the frequency. Let's go.